It's Clifford. It's Clifford. The big red dog. Hey, guess what? It's Clifford's birthday today. Want to help with the party? Type in your name and we can put on a party that's just the right size for Clifford. Big. Or if you want to play a card. <laughs> now, the letter C. C for Clifford. There's one. A butterfly shaped. That's two. Two more. A heart shaped jewel. You've got three. Pick a diamond. Oh, Clifford will like that. <laughs> Oh, hi. I'm Emily Elizabeth. I'm glad you're here. This is for my dog Clifford. Today is his birthday, and I want him to have the best party ever. There's a lot to do to get ready, and boy, do I need your help. We need to take Clifford to the dog groomer for a haircut and a bath, clean up the backyard for the party, get Clifford a birthday cake, and stop by the post office to pick up a super special birthday package that Grandma sent. Oh, and we can't forget about this. This is a kit to make a birthday collar for Clifford. Huh, I wonder where Clifford is anyway. <coughs> Clifford! Oh, Clifford! Where are you? Clifford won't fit in there. That's the kit to make a birthday collar for Clifford. Oh, Clifford, where are you? How about a nice little doggy treat? <coughs> this is a Clifford-sized treat. But we can't give it to him till we find him. you are? <laughs> Happy birthday, Clifford. <sighs> now we can make your first birthday present of the day. <laughs> Let's take it outside where we'll have more room to work on it. Come on! <laughs> Duels for your new collar, Clifford. Fit for a king. <laughs> Some people make such a fuss over a little sneeze. We'll just need to find the four missing jewels for Clifford's new collar. Let's add it to the list. Well, we better get going. Can you carry these? My backpack will be perfect for carrying stuff. And we can use the map to get around town. So, where do you want to go first? Clifford loves this street. It's because of the market. With all that food, it's his favorite place to visit. Here's the dog grooming place. Maybe Mr. Kibble, the groomer, can give Clifford a haircut and a bath so he'll look his birthday best. Hi, Peaches. Hi, Mr. Kibble. It's Clifford's birthday and we oh, were oh. wondering... Uh, you weren't wondering if I could groom Clifford, were you? You, you see, the thing is, uh, Clifford is so... Uh, so... big. He, he's huge, giant, gargantuan, humongous. He's rather large. I'm taking the rest of the day off. I guess Clifford's size makes Mr. Kibble a little nervous. That's okay, Clifford. I'm sure we can convince Mr. Kibble to help you get your birthday haircut and bath. We just have to find him. Hello? <whistles> you want who? <whistles> Sorry, wrong number. But uh, tell me, do you have any crackers? Oh, too bad. <coughs> Mr. 
Mr. Kibble was mm. sure in a hurry. We need to find him so Clifford can have his hair cut and bath. Hi, Emily. Clifford! How about 125 ice cream cones? Just kidding. So, what'll it be for the lucky owner of the birthday dog? What do you have, Sandy? Ooh, they all look so good. Go ahead and pick one. Hmm, which... Mmm, yummy! A scoop of mint ice cream in a cone with a cherry on top. Here you go. Thanks. What do I owe you? Not a penny. Since Clifford's the birthday dog, I'll give it to you for free. It's on the house. All day long. Wow. Thanks, Sandy. Sure. And I have a special doggy ice cream treat for the birthday dog. Catch, Clifford. Woof! Excellent! The market's just the place to get Clifford's birthday cake. Hello, Mr. Hamburger. Hello, Emily Elizabeth. Happy birthday, Clifford! Woof! Clifford loves Mr. Hamburger. I wonder if it has anything to do with his name. Here's a treat for ya! Oh, no. My lovely lunch display. I'm sorry, Mr. Hamburger. Sometimes Clifford gets a little too excited. <laughs> but I'm sure we can do something to fix this. Now, we just need to clean up the rest of this mess. And later, we'll see about Clifford's birthday cake. picture that goes on top of the display has broken into pieces. Okay, let's see if we can glue these pieces together. Oh boy, you did it! Mr. Hamburger will be happy about this. Come on. Good job. Woof. Good as new. Now we need to do something about all that food. Great. Let's put all the stuff back on the shelves. Okay. Let's see if we can put these things back on the shelves in just the right way. Mr. Hamburger likes to have all the same kind of food together on the same shelf. Chips. 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 Bean soup. Bean soup. Sardines. 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 Soup. Soup. Gingerbread cookies. Chocolate chip. Tuna. Tuna. 
tuna. All right, you put everything in its place. Good job. Woof. That looks great. Oh, that's perfect. I couldn't have done it any better myself. Now we can see about getting Clifford's birthday cake for the party. I'm gonna bake one especially just for Clifford. <laughs> All you have to do is pick the icing and the decorations. Woof! Oh boy, this is gonna be great. You can pick from lots and lots of decorations to make Clifford's birthday cake extra super special. Why? Why? A. A. N. N. T. T. V. V. H. H. A. A. P, P, P. Y, Y. B, B, I, I. R, R. T, T. H, H. D, D, A, A. Y, Y. C, C. L, L, I, I, F, 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 O, O, R, R, D, D, T, T H H E E B B I I G G R R E E D D D O O G G
Five. Five. Clifford's gonna love this cake. Cake is one of his favorite food groups. Good job. Woof. Now I can bake a Clifford-sized cake that looks just like the one you decorated. Oh boy, that's great. I'll bake it a little later just before the party. And we can even decorate another cake later. We just have to let Mr. Hamburger know. It's fun coming here. Clifford has a lot of friends at the beach. <laughs> what this is. A rope ladder. You can borrow it if you want. We have plenty of others for emergencies. Thanks, Loretta. You never know when you might need one. and I like more than a pile of tasty fish sticks. Hi, Loretta. Hey, Emily Elizabeth. And that sweet Clifford. Well, it looks like you could use some of Loretta's special homemade deep fried fish sticks to plump you up. Mmm, Loretta, those look great. Well, help yourself. Did I mention how much Clifford likes fish sticks? Clifford! This could be a problem. Oh no! Rocky, my baby, he's not a good swimmer. What'll we do? We need to get Rocky back. He's one of Clifford's best friends. Woof, woof. Clifford can swim all the way out to rescue Rocky. <laughs> Clifford is a really good swimmer, but getting hit by waves makes him tired. Swimming into seaweed makes him really tired. When Clifford is really tired, he loses all his energy, and he needs to stop and rest. Luckily, fish sticks give him energy. Help Clifford eat fish sticks and stay away from the waves and seaweed. Help him reach Rocky. ran out of energy. He has to take a rest, then he can try again. Clifford, Rocky needs you. I know you can save him. I I just know it. Woof. Rocky, everything's going to be fine. Clifford will save you. Woof. Woof. Clifford's headed back in. Oh, thank goodness. Move Clifford side to side to catch fish sticks and stay away from waves and seaweed. Go get Rocky. <laughs> Mm-hmm. <laughs> 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 
to mama. We're all born. Clifford. Oh, Clifford, thank you so much. You have earned free Ooh. fish sticks for life, my dear. Ooh. That's my dog. Great job, Clifford. Ooh. Clifford! It's one of the missing jewels from your birthday collar. Good job. Woof. Woof, woof, woof. Whale. I can't think of a better birthday present than getting to swim with a whale. Have fun, Clifford. <laughs> Help Clifford swim out to play with the whale. Remember, help him eat fish sticks for energy and stay away from waves and seaweed. Now that's what I call a whale of a friendship. Woof! Woof! <laughs> Clifford! Help! Help! I bet this will work. Woof! Okay, Mr. Kibble, we're ready. Oh, happy day. Here I come. 
Are you okay, Mr. Kibble? I'm more than okay. I'm just swell. You know, you're the doggone best. Gee, now that you're out of the tree, do you think you could give Clifford his birthday haircut and bath? I'd love to, but he is big, huge, gargantuan. There is no way he could fit in my tub. But I'll be happy to lend you my grooming kit. Uh, I'm sure you can find some place big enough to wash Clifford. <laughs> Thanks, Mr. Kibble. Go get it, Clifford. Clifford loves to play fetch. Whoa! <laughs> Oh, no. Clifford picked up the wrong stick. Sorry about that. Oh, that's okay. It was kind of fun. Woof! Woof! Go get it, Clifford. Clifford loves to play fetch. Home run! Hello again. I could do this all day. <laughs> Clifford, it's one of the missing jewels from your birthday collar. Here, little froggy. Ribbit, ribbit, ribbit. <laughs> wow, he's good. Good job. <laughs> That pond's the perfect size to give Clifford a bath, but we're not allowed to go in. It might upset the fish. That pond's the perfect size to give Clifford a bath, but we're not allowed to go in. It might upset the fish. I think Clifford is too big to fit in that balloon Ooh. basket. Oh, my favorite scarf! <laughs> Thanks, Cliffy. You're a dream. Sometimes Clifford forgets to look both ways before crossing the street. Hey, let's go! We need to do something about this traffic jam. need to get home. Great idea! Clifford can take the cars where they need to go. Okay, so which car should Clifford help first? Hey! It's Godzilla! He must <laughs> Clifford may need your help finding the way. Make sure you know where the driver needs to go. This is a map of part of our town. The person will tell you where they need to go. Then click on Clifford and drive him to the right place. Thanks for the lift. I live in the house with the blue roof that's around the corner from the purple house. <laughs> Thanks for the lift. I live in the house with the blue roof that's around the corner from the purple house. Thanks for the lift. I live in the house with the blue roof that's around the corner from the purple house. Gee, thanks. Great. Now pick another car. I hope you can help me. 
I am on my way to visit my friend Bob. He lives in the house with two tall trees that's opposite a yellow house. Thank you. Now, which car should Clifford help? I'm bringing flowers to a sick friend. She just had an operation. I'm bringing flowers to a sick friend. She just had an operation. I'm bringing flowers to a sick friend. She just had an operation. I'm bringing flowers to a sick friend. She just had an operation. I'm bringing flowers to a sick friend. She just had an operation. Thanks. Who should we help now? Am I glad you're helping me? I'm headed to visit my brother. His house is in the middle of a field of flowers. Thanks. Great. Now pick another car. I'm going to see my aunt. She lives in a house with a diamond window and a red door. There are two tall trees on her block. This is the place. Now which car should Clifford help? I'm headed home. I live in a house right next to the pond. The flower bush outside my house is not pink. <laughs> I'm headed home. I live in a house right next to the pond. The flower... <laughs> This is the place. Who should we help now? I'm going home to water the garden. I live in the blue house next to the pink flower bush. Thanks a bunch! You cleared up the traffic jam! Now the rest of the cars can get going! Woof. Good job! Woof. Clifford feels much better now that you helped him fix his mistake. Woof. Hey, if you want to help another car, just click on it. Whoa! Look what you found! One of the missing jewels from Clifford's oh, birthday yeah. collar. Go get it, Clifford. Woo -woo.
Got it. Good job. Those are our neighbors, Horace and Violet Bleakman. Sometimes they're very grouchy, but they can be nice, too. Mm. Hey! Don't touch the flowers! Hey, look what this is! A package for Ramona Diamond and her dog, Ruby, from Groomingdale's. The postal carrier delivered it today. It's not ours. That's okay. We'll make sure she gets it. Hey! Watch where the fur flies! Clifford likes to scratch, but sometimes he gets carried away. The Bleakmans have a really nice pool. This pool would be the perfect place to give Clifford a birthday bath. I wonder if Mr. and Mrs. Bleakman will let us use it. We should ask them. Mr. and Mrs. Bleakman! Your pool is pretty big. Could we use it to give Clifford his birthday bath? Hmm, maybe. But we can't possibly think about that now. We are way too hungry. What do you want? I don't know exactly. I want something cold. Cold and white. Cold and white with a cherry on top. I guess we need to keep on the lookout for something cold and white with a cherry on top. <laughs> Whoa! Do you see what I see? The last missing jewel. Woof! <laughs> Woof! Hey! That was the last jewel we needed to find. <laughs> we can make Clifford's collar now. Woof! <laughs> Each of these jewels has a place on the collar. See if you can put them in the right places. A heart-shaped jewel. A butterfly-shaped jewel. Duck, a diamond. That's it. One to go. The letter C. C for Clifford. Clifford's new birthday collar is perfect. Thanks. Good job! Woof. Hello again, Emily Elizabeth. Hi, Clifford. Could you use another ice cream? I sure could, Sandy. Hmm, which one should we pick? Mmm, yummy. A scoop of vanilla in a cone with a cherry on top. Sandy, can you put it in a freezer bag to keep it cold? Sure. Thanks. Let's put this in the backpack. Those are our neighbors, Horace and Violet Bleakman. Sometimes they're very grouchy, but they can be nice, too. Mm. Here you go, Mr. and Mrs. Bleakman. It's perfect. Just what we asked for. And you didn't even step on the flowers. Oh, and about the pool. Use it. We never use it.
Oh boy, we can use the pool. I can't believe my ears. Can you clip it? <laughs> Okay, Clifford, bath time. Hey! We said you could get in the pool, not get the pool on us. Some people make such a fuss over a little water. Look at all this stuff we can use to groom Clifford. Wow, Clifford, you're going to look your birthday best. Rinse water. Soap. Rinse water. Scissors. Scissors. Brush. Rinse water. Purple hair color. Yellow hair color. Yellow hair color. Yellow hair color. Colored polka dot hair color. Plaid hair color. Wow, Clifford, look at you. You are a handsome dog. Good job. Okay, Clifford, back in the pool. Clifford just loves this, don't you, boy? Rinse water. Rinse water. Rinse water. Rinse water. Yellow hair color. Colored polka dot hair color. Plaid hair color. Colored polka dot hair color. Wow, Clifford. Look at you. You are a handsome dog. Clifford and I like walking downtown. Believe it or not, everyone seems to know him. Maybe it's because he's such a great dog. I'm getting ready for Clifford's party. Has anyone seen Sparky? to pick up the special package that Grandma sent for Clifford's birthday. Whoa. It's Ramona Diamond and her dog, Ruby. Hello, Ramona. Hey, that looks like Clifford's birthday package. Well, Ooh. we were expecting a package today for Ruby, all the way from Groomingdale's in the big city. And it does say to the best dog in the world. But that package also says from Grandma. Ooh. Oh, that part. Well, if this isn't our package, I don't know what I'll do. 
We need all that fun stuff from Grooming Dales for Ruby to wear to Clifford's party. Ramona, we'll Ooh. find your package for Ruby. Oh, okay, thanks. And I'll take good care of yours until you find mine. We'll wait right here. Good. Great. Thanks. Wait a minute, Clifford. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? Woof! Oh, Ramona, I have something for you. It's the package from Groomingdale's. Oh, thank goodness. Now Ruby will look spectacular for Clifford's party. Thanks for finding it. You're welcome. See you at the party. This is it, Clifford. Your super special birthday surprise from Grandma. Woof. Clifford wants to open it. But we'll just have to wait until the party. Good job! Woof. Maud, we found the package for Ramona. It was delivered to the wrong address. Well, you know what I always say. The mail always gets delivered, but it doesn't always get delivered to the right mm -hmm. place. This is our backyard. And this is where we're going to have Clifford's party. But first, we have to do something about this mess. Very stylish, Clifford. Clifford likes to collect stuff and bury it here in the backyard. But since this is where we're having the party, we need to clean up. Woof, woof. Which gives me an idea. Maybe we can make it easier for Clifford to put his stuff away. We could dig up his things and find the stuff that goes together. You know, like a ball and a bat, a girl and her dog. Okay. Dig up one mound at a time and find the things that go together. Violin. Drumstick. Mm, guess not. Salt. Nail. Toothbrush. Comb. Oops. Hairbrush. Comb. Yes! Dustpan. Bow. Violin. Bow. Woof. That's it. Picture frame. Hammer. Uh-uh. Salt. Drum. <laughs> Drumstick. Drum. You got it. Nail. Hammer. Woof. Yep, they go together. Toothpaste. Toothbrush. Yes! Broom. Dustpan. Woof! Yes! Pepper. Salt. That's it. Picture. Picture frame. Woof! You got it. Wow! You did it! Woof! <laughs> Wow, you are a cleaning whiz. Good job. Woof. If you want to dig up more of Clifford's things, just click on the shovel. We'll leave it here on the fence. And now, 
da 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 It's time to decorate Clifford's doghouse. This says, Happy Birthday, Clifford, from us. It's looking like a party doghouse now. Wait a minute, Clifford. Do you know what that means? We've done everything we need to do. So, do you know what time it is? Ooh. It's time for Clifford's birthday party. Wow, so I wonder where everybody is. <laughs> For you, Clifford, because you're the best dog ever. It's from me and our new friend. I think Clifford likes it. And he really likes you. Here you go. A birthday bow for Clifford. Special delivery for Clifford. Happy birthday, Clifford. I've been thinking you might be hungry, so open wide, birthday dog. <laughs> Are you having fun at Clifford's birthday party, Rubikins? Ice cream, you scream, we all scream for ice cream. Special delivery for my favorite big red dog! Oh boy! Now that's what I call a good-looking cake. Woof! Woof! For my favorite big red dog! <coughs> Clifford, it's time to open your super special birthday package from Grandma. Oh, boy! It's a super special soccer ball. Clifford loves soccer. Come on, let's play. This is going to be fun. First, pick four of Clifford's pals to be on the other team. If you pick one and change your mind, just click on the dog again. Sparky, Rocky, Raffles, Ruby. We're ready to play Clifford's birthday soccer game. Okay, what level do you want to play? Beginner, soccer pro, or super soccer star? Super Soccer Star! Great! Here's how it works. Move Clifford right and left to block the ball. Then click and Clifford will kick the ball. Try to keep the ball out of our goal and see if you can get it into the other goal. Ready? Set? Let's play!
Do you want to play another game of Clifford's birth? Great soccer game. <laughs> Here's a song I wrote just for Clifford. Who's the biggest dog around? <laughs> Who's the reddest dog in town? <laughs> Ooh, yeah.